Um, there is no new beginnings in Washington. I certainly think it will be a factor in the overall reputation of, um, uh, of Prime Minister Modi, especially among progressives. Um, I think Sanjay was right, absolutely, that we have a situation in which the progressives in Congress ha are increasingly powerful, are trying to shape the narrative, which is why it's so essential mm -hmm. that behind the scenes that the atmospherics and the chemistry is good. It would be a mistake to talk too much about Afghanistan mm -hmm. because President Biden is so set in his ways. Perhaps that's a conversation that can be had with National Security Advisor Jake Sullivan instead. Mm -hmm. Likewise, what we've seen at other meetings, for example, when Iraqi Prime Minister Mustafa Qadami came, is that former Secretary of State John Kerry had representatives in almost every meeting, wanted to hear about climate change, and in order to improve the chemistry, it would behoove Prime Minister Modi to play along and then deal with the strategic issues behind the scenes. But are, are you saying, uh, Michael Rubin, that issues of human rights, religious freedom will be raised at all? Because those are contentious issues. Or is this basically an icebreaker meeting? What I'm saying is that the core of the relationship between India and the United States isn't simply between President Biden and Prime Minister Modi. Mm -hmm. It's important that the chemistry between the two leaders is good. But behind the scenes, much more important is going to be the relationships which are established by their various staff members, mm -hmm. which aren't going to be on camera, because even though I doubt Biden will bring up human rights issues in his meeting, Congress mm -hmm. cannot be ignored. Naptej Sarda, you've dealt with the complexity in that sense of Washington. Do you believe that, as uh, uh, Mr. Rubin says, this is not just about Prime Minister Modi and President Biden. It's about the institutional framework. It's also about other stakeholders and how do you deal with them? Do you believe Will contentious I... issues should be set aside and the focus should be at the moment on confidence building? Well, uh, Rajdeep, you know, a, a short, compact prime ministerial visit does not touch everything. Mm -hmm. They don't resolve all problems. They don't get into nitty gritty. Mm -hmm. This is a first meeting between President Biden and Prime Minister Modi after the Biden presidency has started. Mm -hmm. This is the first in-person quad. President Biden needs good visit here by not only by India, but the others. He's under pressure uh, on domestic uh, issues. He's, he's under pressure post Afghanistan. He wants to show that America is back in leadership. America is taking on China in a strong way. And mm -hmm. that's why we left Afghanistan. America is engaged in the Indo-Pacific. I do not think that he or Kamala Harris will use this of these meetings to raise contentious issues and clear the pitch. Mm -hmm. If anything has to be mentioned, it will be mentioned in the sense of how 